Inspector Owen Elloy, E L L O Y, up in Mancravat Police. Concerns are mounting for the well being of 31 year old um, Jade Brisky, a woman from a Holland Park West address. Um, Jade is born with Down syndrome and has the mental capacity of a young child. Police investigating confirm her last whereabouts as being on Bar Pium Road at Holland Park West, verging on Tarragindi. Jade is described as being 148 centimetres tall. She has light brown hair cut in what could be described as a long bob. Uh, she's wearing black uh, baggy pants with pink crop type shoes. She's carrying a blue and cream backpack with the word scenic tours on it, possibly containing a basketball. She's also carrying a shoulder type calico bag uh, containing pencils and colouring in type um, uh, material. <coughs> Police would like anyone living in the Greater Holland Park West Tarragindi area to please be vigilant of uh, please be vigilant of sorry Police would ask for anyone living in the Greater Holland Park Tarragindi area to be vigilant of their surrounds, in particular those living with bushland in their vicinity, uh, bikeways and uh, watercourses. If they could check their, uh, their own areas and uh, any information, any information at all, can be phoned through to Crime Stoppers on 1800 333 000. What is the search um, area at this stage? At this stage we're concentrating on the um, the more easterly side of the Tui Forest and the uh, Greater Weller Hill area. And how many people are involved in the search? At this stage we have over 60 SES personnel and approximately 42 police on trail bikes, horses, foot uh, and patrols. What information have you received? What information have you received from the public? There's a, there's a um, a large amount of information starting to come in. Um, obviously, uh, a lot of it's being run out by um, by our uh, people uh, in that uh, Green Slopes and Tarragindi area. Some of it is promising. Um, more information is always good. Do we think she's just wandered off? Is that the, the thought of this stage? Yes, exactly. There was apparently a sighting of her yesterday. Uh, a neighbour is believed to have sighted her in that Barpium Road area at approximately 10, 11 o'clock yesterday morning. Is that a reliable account? It is, yes. What was her frame of mind? Uh, has her family said, was she upset beforehand or was no. this out of the ordinary? No, nothing, nothing at all, unfortunately. What yeah. happened yesterday? Was her mum, did her mum go out and then she found the key? Is that what happened? Her mother and stepfather did go out. They had a prior appointment and... Um, She's made her way out of the house, essentially, yes. How are her parents dealing with this, obviously, out of the ordinary? They're upset. But we, uh, we haven't got anything suspicious to base our inquiries on at this stage. But what they're obviously, you know, fairly uh, panicky about the fact she's been gone for almost two days. Very much so. Very much so. Um, as you can imagine, a, essentially a person with a um, childlike mentality, um, concerns are held crossing roads, etc., are, are an issue. Where does the search go from here? We're uh, doubling up on our search areas in that general vicinity and extending as we get more personnel um, into that uh, greater Tui forest area. And it'll go across the weekend? I'm sorry? It'll go across yes. the weekend? Yes, oh yes, definitely. If we don't have a breakthrough in the interim. Okay? Great. Thank you. Thank you.